Hi, I'm Dion, welcome to my studio. Now I'm gonna be telling you about an exciting project that you're going to be involved in. So we are going to be working with other groups, but we're not gonna actually see them and meet them. We're going to communicate through artwork. So we have got the great chance and opportunity of being the first people to start the conversation. Now we're thinking about how books can be given as gifts. And I don't mean just giving somebody as a present, I mean how we can share knowledge and how we can share stories. And you might have had this before where somebody's told you a story and then maybe you've added a little bit to that story and then they, maybe the next person's added a bit to that story and it's changed and it's evolved. And that is the beautiful thing about storytelling is that it does change and it evolves. And when you give somebody a story, you're sharing an experience, you're sharing something that can grow and you can use your imagination and each person will see different pictures when they hear that story. So we're going to be focusing on a story in the classroom and what I'd like you to do is I'd like you to take from it what you find really interesting and if you were to take a snapshot in your mind, your imagination of what you can picture when you're thinking about that story. That's what we're going to capture on our canvases. Now these canvases are going to be shared with other groups and one of those groups is an older group and it's an older group that's in hospital. So they're in hospital and they're going to be receiving your artwork as a gift really because then they're going to add their thoughts on the story to it. And then they're going to gift it to another group and they'll add their thoughts on the story. So each time the canvas is going to be added to and a different part of the story will evolve. So you have a very, very important job with starting with the story and starting with the canvas. So what I'd like you to do is take one part of the canvas where you'd like to add your story and I'd like you to take three parts of the story. So try and think of it as a, a beginning, a middle and an end. And you're going to add images to try and convey that. So I'm going to add three images and I'm going to do that just with a paint pen because paint pens are brilliant because they mean that you have to draw really quickly you also can't rub things out, so you're going with your gut instinct, what you really think, what you really want to convey. And I'm going to get you to do just that. So I'm adding my three things. And then, once I've drawn them out, I'm going to add some more paint into it. So I'm going to add more detail, but this is just giving me the line. It's kind of making me make the decision of what I'm going to, what I'm going to choose, what I'm going to do. So I'm also going to do a house as well. So these are really, really simplified drawings. And then I can enjoy adding more detail and adding a little bit more information about the things that I'm taking from the story.